What is up, peeps? We are back with another Ark Survival Evolved video. Today, I've been talking about it for a while, and I'm super excited. Today, we are going to tame a horsey. And I thought we'd just skip to when I actually found it, because they're not hard to find, but it's hard to find a good level. Because they don't really spawn all over the place. And there it is. Female 140. Um, I've probably killed at least 30 of these things. Searched everywhere. Um, finally found some over here. Um, the wiki's telling me that they spawn more often on like the south island something or the other. I don't know. But I literally didn't find any over there. So, and these are the only like four I've found. I don't know where the other one went. But, yeah, so we're going to try this out. Um, I have not tamed one of these at all yet, so we're going to see how it goes. Um, I know the gist of it, though, so uh, let's put this guy on passive. Yeah, we'll put him on passive. And I think uh, he should be good, I hope. We'll find out. Oh no, why are you going to come straight at me? So I don't exactly know how this works. But I know you have to like passively give them something and then jump on and start riding them around until you tame them. Um, I don't know, we're going to find out. Oh, I scared him. Okay, so you do have to sneak up on them. I don't have a ghillie suit, and that probably would have been a better idea. But I don't have one. So we're going to have to go at it this way. And just try and be sneaky. Come here, horse. Crap. He's a running. Okay, now he stopped. Alright, we are really far from the RG, so hopefully nothing bad happens. Hopefully I don't get attacked by anything. No, why are you going on a rock? Don't go on a rock. Where are you at? Where are you at, bro? Okay, I'm thinking I can get up. And then, oh no, don't turn around. Come here, horse. Oh my god, I don't know why my textures are so jacked up. I can't wait until the optimization. It's going to be great. Oh no, don't spin around. Are you inside of a wall? What in the world? Oh, secret. Secret hiding place. Oh, okay. So, I had to see... Oh my goodness. Um, I didn't realize I had to immediately sue them. Um, okay, and I'm knocked out. Alright guys, so I have a plan. Um, I kind of messed up his effectiveness, which for some reason I can't even see now. I don't know. But, I'm going to try, hopefully I don't mess this whole thing up because it took so long to find these guys. But I didn't realize this, after you feed him and then you jump on, you immediately have to feed him again. It just doesn't make sense with normal arc, so I wasn't exactly prepared for it. Um, so I messed up his effectiveness and then jumped on and accidentally fell off. I don't know what happened. So it won't reset. So I'm going to see if I knock him out and then bring him back if it'll reset. Don't go anywhere. So that's my plan. And then I'm thinking... I'll also put him in a pin, so that way, there we go, so he's out. So I'm going to also put him in a pin, so that way when he does start to run around, um, I'm kind of safe. So I thought we'd, you know how I am, I like the pins. So a pin's not really a great um, option on this one usually, because you don't want to put him unconscious, but I kind of had no choice. Um, and I can't. I also can't access his inventory, which kind of stinks. So he's gonna have to wake up in, himself. 
um, which is a bummer, but I think, yeah, I can watch it from here. So, it's going down decent, decently quick. Yeah, decently quick. Um, shouldn't take too long. Um, I'm going to build the pin around him and go get the RG. And then hopefully it resets. Um, I would hope so. I don't know. So, I'm going to set this pin up real quick. Um, hope, hopefully, once again, this will help me out with the whole taming issue and when I get it all set up I'll bring you guys back alright BRBs nope there we go alright guys it's up and it's in our little pin um I still haven't checked it yet I'm waiting for it to turn around kind of so I don't want to startle it I guess it's not a big deal and he can't get out the door so we don't really have to worry about it let's see see no it didn't reset it at all I don't think and I think we scared it crap I don't know if you can reset these things and it's saying I can't ride it well, obviously because it's scared right now, but I might have just not seen it before. Oh, this dude. Oh, I thought he just went into the freaking rock again. Alright. Well, let's wait a second. I definitely should have got a ghillie suit. Alright. So it did reset. Awesome. So I got out of the render distance, came back, and it reset. So this is fantastic. I just got to watch this bar and make sure I feed him. I cannot mess up. Because this will be an awesome horse. 209 levels. Come on, horsey. Have some carrots. All right, and this pin's working out perfect. So this way, because they usually just run in any random direction. Like, you don't send them in a certain area. They just run, and you just ride along and then soothe them with carrots when they need it. So with this little pin, this way I can stop them from running, and they stay in the little area that I put them in. And I'm sure if I got the, um, what is it, the, like, honey from the bees the beehive and you can lead animals certain ways then you can lead them into your own pen and then try and tame them there that would probably be a little bit simpler but I don't have any beehives yet which is something that we need to possibly look at in the future I'm trying to get maybe in the next couple episodes but I've been wanting to get this horse for a while so luckily we found an awesome one come on horsey eat some more come on horse one more come on boom tamed an equus um I I have no idea what to name it um we'll come back to that awesome so now I can actually run around with it um I believe yes I do have it which it's awesome now you can just press R2 and it equips the saddle so fantastic nice I love this saddle it's so cool alright so now I need to get him out of here um I might I'm just gonna leave this thing here I don't see why not I'll take that one out and we'll just leave the structure here we can use it in the future I have little taming pins everywhere awesome so let's look at his stats um, what does he have 2600 health okay not not terrible not great stamina 3600 that's amazing weight 659 that's not bad um, oxygen 838 food 10,000 melee 758 that seems pretty decent um, movement speed is 130 I mean he moves pretty quick it's not crazy quick but it's fast enough um, and it does do torpor, so let's do L2, 
is the Torpor Kick. A little Buck and Bronco. Um, this is the little the little nibble. Oh, and that one, when I look to the left, it does like a little head swipe. Oh, no, it's just random, I guess. Awesome. He can jump. Looks awesome. And then, does he have anything else? Oh, yeah, he has like a little... Oh, that's amazing. He has his own little, like, I guess, roar type thing. <laughs> that's sick. And then, let me look. We might need to gather some materials, but you can um, make a lasso. So you can, um, he does, um, like, mortar and pestle stuff. And then you can also make lassos. So thatch and fiber. Let's get some thatch and fiber real quick. And then you can make a lasso and lasso dinos or players or whatever. Um, give me you. Where'd you go, horse? Oh, you're following me. Okay, stop following me. There we go. Um, let's lasso this bad boy up. All right. Let's make um, let's make all of them. I don't care. Okay, so do I? I think I have to equip them. Okay. Um, first, let me put. So I have them, but I don't think I can use them only on the horse. So. Um, I gotta put these carrots on here because I don't want them to spoil. Eat on there. All right, so no, I can't use it off the horse, but on the horse, nice. Oh, but the thing is, I have to steer with this. I'm so terrible at steering like this. Okay, let's go. Can we get a parasaur? Oh, I know you can get a pig. Let's, oh, what about this other horse? Nice. Is that a 90? Yeah, it is. Oh, that's so cool. So I have him. He's trying to get away. Nice. So what? Oh, okay. What about... Oh, I got him. And pulling him in. That's awesome. So can I like reel him in or anything? I don't think I can reel him in. And then L2 gets rid of it. So and it uses one every time. Okay. So they're not reusable at all. Um Oh, I missed. Um, I want to try... Let's try and get something big. This Parasaur's pretty big. Let's try this bad boy out. Nope. It's too big. So it's got to be smaller than a Parasaur, I guess. Got him. That's awesome. Get back over here. So what happens if I pull a... Oh, if I pull my gun out, it gets rid of it. This thing's actually a lot easier to steer while like um while like aiming I'm still not very good at it but it seems a lot easier see I can't even hit anything yeah it's a lot easier though um yeah we're gonna get him back to uh, well her get her back to base she's awesome let's see uh, we got one um let me see what uh, I want to put some health in there first. Wow, a thousand. A thousand HP every pump. That's awesome. Which it's not going to be the same for everybody. I have my stats different than everyone else. But that's still awesome for my server. That's pretty good. So I'm going to get him back to base. Uh, we're going to get some stuff ready for what we're doing next. And then I'll show you something um, big that I was working on that I got all finished and done up um, just so that we can get closer to start breeding dinos. So, I'll meet you back at base. Alright guys, we're not back yet, but this guy, so this guy doesn't do a lot of damage. Um, here, let's put this guy on passive. So you can see it here. So, only like 60, but 
this one it does about 95 but I didn't get to show you on that one um I don't want to fight two trikes let me see if I can find something real quick up here and I'll show you this thing does a pretty decent amount of torpor it's pretty crazy so here we go parasaur he's out two hits I hit him three times but he was out on the second one it's only a 25 but I mean still it does a good amount of torpor and the um, here I'll show you real quick the melee I think goes up by about a hundred yeah a little bit more than a hundred so he's almost at a thousand uh, um, damage goes up by over a hundred so it is a pretty decent amount but man this this torpor is just insane stego three hits down it's a 15 but still it's a stego and that's just insane and now we're doing a hundred each time I mean I want to get this dude leveled up and then try him out on a Rex and see what we can get what we can accomplish with that oh come on I keep getting stuck inside stuff there we go okay all right well let's see what our next victim can be let's get this one again let's do Oh, get out of my way, bird. Oh, he's running. He's running. Level 80. I mean, that wasn't really that difficult. That's awesome. What's up, guys? So, on my way back, taking the other one back home, I found this one. Um, they weren't spawning in this area before, but now they are. So, I will take it. Um, I... Decided to just try. It was a pretty safe area. I cleared out some of the other stuff. I decided to just try and do it normal way. Just ride them around. Um, but it seems to be going down. Like you can see the taming percentage. Like it's taking forever for him to like get soothed. And it's slowly going down every time. But I still got 100% effectiveness. Just, I don't understand why it keeps going down. Oh yeah, stay in this tree. So you can kind of like try and lead him in a certain direction. So he's trying to go left and I'm pulling right. But I don't know if that slows it down. I don't know. It's going up a little bit. So I'm at 70% now. So I'm going to hurry up and get... Well, I'm going to try and hurry up. Get this one tamed up. And then we'll head back to base. We'll check them both out. Um, oh, there we go. Yes, almost done. But I'll take this one back to base. We'll check them out, and then I've got some other stuff to show you, and some stuff to do. We gotta get done. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Barbies. All right, guys, we're back. And I end, <laughs> I ended up taming this guy up too. Um, level two sixteen. He attacked me, and quick little two hitter from this guy knocked him out cold and I saw it was a 145 I was like ah it, it had to be so I went ahead and tamed him up um, yeah he was a 145 so I was like ah why not we'll go ahead and take it so we got that guy as well no not for any real reason I mean he attacked us and we knocked him out and it was super easy so I went ahead and grabbed it super easy tame but we got this guy so awesome ended up 197 um, I don't need a saddle. I need to get one for him, though. Let's see. Let's let's introduce him. Or wait, 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 wait. We can't introduce him yet. He doesn't have a saddle on, so we, we got to get a saddle for him. Here, I'll hide him over here. You stay over here, buddy. He got a glimpse. He was like, "Ooh, who's that lady over there?" But we we can't we can't do that. That's just too fast. He's got to be looking good. He's a little bloody too. We got in a fight with a Brano. Because we had to get prime. So, what we need to do, I think it's in here. Um, saddles. What do I need for this saddle? Uh, let's day it on. Equus. Nothing. I've already got it. Okay. Whoa. Oh, now I need fiber. I'll have to bring more fiber over here. That's fine. Alright. Boom. We got his saddle. Um, should we paint it up a little bit? Maybe make him look a little snazzy. We'll give him like a little gold trim or something on there. 
Um, what else should we go with? Um, let's make it sleek. Let's make it some black. Black and gold? Sounds good, right? So let's see, what we got? What we got going on? So, we definitely want the buckles to be blinging. Some bling blau buckles. Um, oh, that looks really freaking cool. There we go. So we want the buckles. We want the gold. Um, what's this? Pouch? No, we're gonna make the pouch. Ooh, that looks cool. And then that's the top part. So, we want to do this. Yeah, that one black. We might switch that one up. We want that one a different color. Um, pouch black. Yeah. And then that part black. And then we want to do this one yellow for sure. And then maybe the top one yellow as well. That looks good, right? Awesome. Okay, that'll work. So we got them all. We got a saddle all pimped out for them. Let's go put it on there. I still... Oh, actually, I do know what to name him. Got a good name. You'll see the name of her in a little bit, too. All right, buddy. You ready? You ready for this? I think that's right. Sea biscuit. I don't know. We'll figure it out. I'll look it up and see if I... Oh, I spelled the biscuit wrong. I'll fix that later. Awesome. Oh, he looks awesome. Oh, the rope's yellow, too. All right, he looks pretty cool. I think he's ready. Oh, the rope back there is yellow. Dude, you look amazing. Are you ready, buddy? Yeah, he said yes. He said yes. Okay. Trot on in there. Look at him. Look at him strutting his stuff. Oh, he's calling out to her. He's like, look at me, pretty lady. I'll bring her over to you. Mr. C Biscuit, look at him playing all nonchalant, like, oh, what's up? How you doing? How you guys doing over here? You like your new buddy? Meet C Biscuit. He's gonna be your boyfriend. Oh, uh, yeah. They're best friends. Oh. oh, yeah. They're in love, guys. They're in love. Well, they're gonna be having babies soon. Someday I'll have to paint her saddle up too, so you guys both are all schnazzy. That turned out really cool. I like the yellow and black. Um, we'll have to do. We'll have to go with some colors on this one too. Awesome. Well, that is fantastic. I can't believe it took so long to find this one. Oh, we ended up naming her. Um, shout out to some Zelda way back when. Um, Epona, Link's horse. So I had to go with that one, and then Sea Biscuit on this one. It's just fantastic. Um, they look pretty much the same. Um, oh no, she's got like prominent stripes on her. Awesome. They look freaking cool. I can't wait to breed these guys up and get an imprinted horse. It's going to be amazing. So that one's 197. I did level this one up, so 219, but it was a 135 and a 130. So it'll still be really good. Um, yeah, so here, I'm going to go ahead. Um, actually, we'll let these guys hang out together. You guys just chill over there for a bit. Um, I did, let me go down here, let me see, I think I have some prime meat, it might have all just spoiled because I was taking so long, yeah, it's about to spoil, um, yeah, seconds left, okay, I'm not worried about it, but this bad boy, um, I did this the other day, I was gonna record it and I started to, but then with my whole platform that I made, um, with these angles and the way the, like, ceilings are lined up and all that, it ended up turning out to be like really difficult to figure out how I was gonna lay it out and everything so it was just becoming confusing so I decided just to go ahead and build it and then I'd show it off and like put it into action and everything later um, but this is our um, smokehouse so I think I'm gonna put like a little sign up right there where that gap is and put like smokehouse or whatever on it um, but I kinda just decorated out here I moved the cooking pot over here so we can use it um, on this side. Um, this is all just decoration, um, just random stuff. 
out here. Um, I need to change these pillars. I want the bottom pillars to be stone, like this bottom, just this bottom one, and then the rest wood. Just because I think it'll look a little bit better having, um, like, this part, um, which I need to add one more on there. It's off, but it's all right. But having the bottom part stone and then the rest of it wood, just because I don't like the way the wood comes all the way down. I think one stone pillar and then wood going up would be a lot better. Yeah, but then I got this little porch, more decoration stuff out here. I kind of just decorate it for fun. Um, chairs, a little storage box for a table. Um, some more little storage boxes. This just for light because um, you have to put wood into the um, torches all the time. And it gets really annoying. So um, these you get for free whenever you die. So whenever I die, I just keep them. And then it gives a decent amount of light because the nights are about half as long as my days are on this game so it's just good enough for the amount of time that's in there um, then I've got some storage chests that I actually use so these two I haven't labeled them yet but this one has my gas in it this one will yeah it has oil which I need to go get some more oil so I might make an oil run um, this one is spark powder um, then right here to cook up some meat whenever I bring it in and then downstairs in the basement I have all the preserving bins so right now, yeah, so I have this one going. It's got two so far. Um, one of them expired, um, spoiled, expired, ex spoiled on me. Um, but yeah, just so I can get some jerky going. Because, I mean, I want to get this breeding started, so I'm going to have to have all the stuff that I need for breeding. Um, this one, got two in there as well going. So yeah, um, I'll probably just, as I probably just start making runs, getting meat. Um, this one, I'm actually going to take this one out. Um, instead, I'm going to run them along the wall that way. I like that idea better. So we'll have them going along that wall that way, this way, and then I'm going to have two more, I think, right in there. And then that'll be all of them. Yeah, but I really like it. I think it turned out pretty awesome. Um, and it was a lot of finagling, like moving stuff around. I didn't really like build stuff in, in advance. I kind of just had all the materials on me and then just built stuff as I needed it. Um, but I... I, pretty, I really like it. I think it turned out pretty cool. So I want to get a tree platform going. Um, I I wanted to get like four of them, so I think I'm going to need some metal. I've got everything else except the metal. I need some more, um, which I did do a metal run. So I just got to get that put in there and start um, smelting down. And where is it? Miscellaneous? Yeah, these. So I need... I'm going to need quite a bit. I think you can put four on each level. So I'm going to have um, four platforms, and I want um, four for each platform. So I'm going to need a lot of these as well. So, um, yeah, 16 of those, four platforms. i got to get all that stuff done. So I'm going to get this metal going, get the materials together, build these bad boys up, and then I'll bring you back when we're putting them up in the trees. We're going to find a nice little area that's just right across from us, so that way it's a short distance, the shortest distance possible, which I think is right over there. Two good trees that are right next to each other. So I'm going to get all this done, and I'll bring you guys back when we're on our way over there. Beer bees. What is up, peeps? We are back. And we've got our stuff. Um, as in platforms is what I mean by stuff. I'm trying to think, I think this is the closest area to it, um, eh, yeah, let's go to this one, <clears throat> I think this is where my, um, taming pin is anyways, the one I left behind from way back when did the terror bird, um, taming, so we might as well just put them right above that, and we'll just go ahead and keep that as like our little red redwood area can't speak um i really wish you could go up to those um ruins and stuff up there that'd be pretty awesome because like you can see them it's kind of like glitched out right now because of the it hasn't loaded in everything but yeah it's got like all these ruins and stuff up there but you can't even go up there that'd be awesome monkey man all right back on track um i believe it's right over here if I can remember correctly. Oh, come on. Come on, game. Um. Crap, where was it? <clears throat> I 
I thought it was right over here. Maybe it's farther this way. Because, yeah, it's right over here. Yep, there it is. Okay, this will do. Zap. So, we're just going to do both of them on this tree. Like so. And... Oh, i got to put the other one on the bar. Um, come here. So. And... Like a so. Who cares what direction you're facing? It does not matter. Alright. And then... Perfect. And then there's our little taming pin thingamabobby. And then we take these bad boys. Put them there. Put them there. Um, where does the next one go? There. Is it just three? I thought it was four per tree. Oh, it is. There we go. Okay. So that should be all of them. Is that all four? I think it's just four. Yes. Okay. So, come here, chicken hawk. Fly, birdie. Watch this. Maneuvers. Anyway, we're champions. All right. So now four over here, and I bl I think this will be enough. I don't see why I would need more than four. Um, four should be plenty. <clears throat> I think that'll that should cover it. Just enough that I need for sap. I mean, um, veggie cakes, um, fishing because I want to do some fishing and get because you can get like ingrams, all kinds of good stuff. So I definitely want to do that, but I think that'll do. Um, we'll have to wait for sap, of course. But also this will be, um, I'll probably put like a little, um, put a little foundation thing and a rope ladder going down um, all the way to the bottom. So that way, whenever I do come to the redwoods, I can leave a dino over here or something and then just climb up and down fly over climb up and down be simpler we'll see all right let us head back nice yeah because I mean I can do two more and put them over there but we'll see how much sap I actually get how long it takes and all that um, and then we'll go from there and see what else we might need to do um, actually you know what while we're here, let's go ahead and destroy some Paraceratherium's faces. There's a bunch of prime meat around here, and then we can work on work out the um, smokehouse. Okay. All right, guys, we are back. Give me all this meat, you hoarder. All right, um, let's go in here. Prime. Yeah, we actually have plenty of time didn't take too long to get back prime but I want to make sure I can get as much done as possible because we got all this prime but it's definitely going to be spoiling um, I probably could have been a little better by just taking enough off the bird that I needed um, but this shouldn't take too long it usually doesn't alright there we go prime get some more in there sweet all right, so get that. All right, while that is cooking, we'll run down here. And then, what was it, prime meat in this one for right now. Um, Way down here. All right, throw that stuff in there. We've got five so far, which is awesome. Um, we still do need to get oil, so I'll probably get some oil. Um, probably on my own time going... Um, stock up on some oil. I don't have anything for water dinos right now to go get oil. Um, eventually I'll probably do that since we do live on an island so it would be easier. But for right now I'll probably just head up to the snow biome and just get those um, oil nodes over there. Well, that is probably going to be it for today. Thank you so much for showing up and watching. I really do appreciate it. Um, we had a bunch of fun. Got so lucky on that second horse. Um, sea Biscuit. So lucky. If you liked it, make sure to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, guys. Bye.
Adios.